Today is actually a really cool day. So I was contacted yesterday about getting shots of a C-130 flying over Louisville. And so I don't know what the mission is um, other than I'm shooting photos of it flying over the city. And so the goal is to fly from here to Louisville to pick up some journalists and then take flight just north of Louisville to catch it, the C-130 flying just over the city. And I need to capture the city, the yellow bridge. And if you've ever been to Louisville, the yellow bridge is right next to the park and right next to the Yum Center and the plane. And it's gonna be, it's like the shot of all shots in my career because I need to catch this plane in focus with an awesome shot of the city and an awesome shot of the bridge and it just needs to be perfect and I only have a few minutes because this aircraft flies roughly at 374 miles an hour and I'll be in a UH-60 Blackhawk which bear with me flies at a speed of 222 miles an hour. So I will only have just a few minutes to capture or to capture this shot. And I don't know where it's going, but I would love to just capture an absolute banger of a photo so that way we could post it wherever. And of course I'm gonna make a printout. But first things first, I have to prep. I'll be using the Sony a7 II with a Sigma uh, 70 to 200 and boy oh boy am I nervous. Here is the Canon 70 to 200 and it is a 2.8 uh, Sigma art and this thing is huge. But I'll be capturing that. And I'll actually have the GoPro Hero 3, which is not a great quality, but it is works. I've ordered two of them. I'll have this on my chest in hopes that it looks good. Uh, if it doesn't, then it's not usable, it's whatever, but I'll be vlogging along with it. But I have to get this shot, like this is the end all be all. Just has to happen. So. I'll take you out throughout today, and the big thing is going to be getting on that helicopter, flying to Louisville, and capturing the C-130, flying over Louisville. I'm really nervous, like super, super nervous to get this shot. However, I have to get it. There's just no if, ands, or buts. Like, I just have to. So, let's make it happen. So it's actually kind of gotten crazier. Um, I will be the only one on the flight and we will be, yeah, I'll be the only one on the flight. And so we're coming down on the time. I'm gonna run and go grab lunch. And I wish this guy would be vlogging it, but it is what it is. But we're gonna be chasing down the thing, the C-130 and praying to God I can get a shot. We'll find out. I came off the the Sony. I am just gonna record on my phone just because I'm all set up. Uh, got the GoPro. I'm heading up to, so we actually have a uh, like a landing pad at the end of this airport. We have an airport on post and then we have the helicopter uh, landing area. And I'm heading up there now to catch the flight. 
I'm gonna be there at 1.30. The flight is supposed to take off at 1.50, and then we will make our way to Louisville to shoot the C-130. To take photos of the C-130, not shoot. But uh, I'm real nervous, I gotta get the shot. Like, I have to get the shot. Um, it's gonna be, theoretically, it could be used on the news, it could be used anywhere, really. So I have to get the shot. No ifs, ands, or buts. Have to. So that's a little nerve wracking. But I'm gonna make it happen. Woo! Let's do it. All right, we're getting ready. We'll be taking off probably in like 15 minutes. We're checking a few things. And we will uh, be uh, heading towards Louisville. Right now, I believe we have to do some testing and then we'll be headed on our way to Louisville. A few quick tests and we will be on our way to take photos of that C-130. This should be a pretty awesome mission. here for about 10 minutes and we have to hold here for another uh, roughly 10 to 15 minutes until the C-130s go through. We're just going to keep circling and uh, trying to get the spot perfect. Um, so we've been through twice. We're going to go around a third time and see if we can find just the perfect spot. Um, again, the thing is, is we're hoping they come in at the right height. This is the Ohio River and you're looking back into Kentucky. All right, we're coming up on where I want them to stop. This is our third time around to uh, make sure we get it perfect. All right, here they come. They're coming in from the right-hand side. You guys should be able to see them pretty clear. Uh, I'm gonna take over and start talking to the pilots. No, no, I think this is perfect. Yeah, this is perfect. Yep, hold here. Hold here. And turn the nose. Turn the nose. Turn. Turn the nose. Turn the nose. Yeah, that's good. Pretty sure I got the shot. It'll have to do. No matter what, but I'm pretty sure we got it. Hell yeah, boys, we got the shot. This looks so good.
a blast. I'll shoot you guys these photos once they're edited. See you, boys. Just got back, I have to go edit these photos, but uh, you can see they're actually doing a fly by for some kids. But I have to hurry up, get a couple of these edited and send them off so that way they can send them off to uh, all the media. Uh, it was a lot of fun. I'll see you back there so I can actually show you the photos. Excuse me, eating an apple. But um. I'm about to pull the images into Lightroom, but uh, you can see it right here. Where is it at? Oh, hell no, I'm not showing you yet. You have to wait till the end for the grand reveal because I need to edit it and whatnot. But I'm I'm pretty happy with it for what we had to do. We weren't high enough. The planes actually came in uh, higher than planned. Um, um, that we were told that they're gonna land or fly around uh, 500 feet, and they were probably about 800 to 1,000, and we were just barely above them. But we got a shot, so let me get it into Lightroom and see what I can do. Alrighty, I got it edited. I sent it off. It was approved. Everyone liked it. I wish it was a little better, but that's just me being super, super, super picky. Um, but damn, that was an incredible experience. It was a lot of fun. Uh, there'll be more opportunities in the future, no doubt. I'm actually headed home. I'm going to change, but I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, I think I'm gonna get back and just sit down and just kind of talk about what everything happened, and then I'll show you the photo. Damn, that was fun. All right, so I got the shot, as I've told you. However, they were supposed to be flying at roughly 500 feet, which should have been just right over the bridge. However, they were probably flying around 1,000 feet, and we were at 800, because I wanted to be roughly 45 degrees away from them so I could get the city, the bridge, and the C-130s, and I wanted to get the top to see the U.S. Air Force. However, that's not the way it went. They were coming in at a right around 1,000 feet and we were at 800. So we had to climb really quickly because they fly right around 350 miles an hour and the Blackhawk, I mean, flying wise because we were just hovering, but we had to haul ass to get up there. And so I only had, I would say 15 seconds from the start of the skyline to the end of the skyline and we wanted them right in the middle. So I roughly had a anywhere between three and eight second window of firing off shots before they were gone and I got the shot and I'm extremely happy everyone's happy I just wish I would have gotten a little bit higher to shoot down into the city and over the C-130 however it all worked out I got the shot it looks incredible in my opinion and here it is